let's see how to export chat transcript to external systems or send as email to your customers so here i'm in the analytics dashboard and it shows all the connected channels right here so let's say a particular customers chat with your business on the instagram or any other channel and if they want to have that particular chat transcript you can actually send it, send it, send it to them through their email as well and also you can use this chat transcript as an input for the chat gpt and analyze other conversation as well so here uh, we actually released a recent update so if you click on uh, the new updates right here and one of the update is we actually introduced four new system fields to handle the chat history so here these are the four fields over here chat history so it simply returns the last 50 messages between the user and the business and if it is chat history large then it simply return last 200 messages between the user and the business so if you want to include who actually sent the messages such as a user or a bot then you can actually use this particular system field chat history details and also likewise chat history details large will simply return a last 200 uh, messages uh, sent between the customer and the bot uh, but also include the who sent the message as well so this is just a, a new fields we introduced recently to handle this particular chat uh, history or if you want to send chat transcript to your customers you can do that so let's see how to send the chat transcript over here so here uh, let's uh, build a new flow over here so go to the flows right here and let me simply name uh, this as um, chat transcript and click continue right here here i am in the new flow chat transcript so here what i'm going to do here is i'm going to use uh, build an a chatbot uh, for the customers and also at the end of the chat i want to ask if they would like to request a chat transcript or something like that so that's possible so here uh, let's start with the action over here and go choose open ai so here you can choose any prompt templates as well uh, so we can actually use existing business information we have so for an example let me choose uh, this one cbb plumbing corporation right here and save the respond to the ai output or something like that and here you can set your own temperature those kind of things are possible so ai output so the response generated using the open ai will be saved in the ai output so we have to send that output to the customer over here which is ai output so let me choose that one AI output so here this is a very simple flow and let's say we provide an option for the customer to request the transcript as well so here uh, let's add a button uh, send transcript or let me name this as send chat transcript some of that and when they choose this button option over here uh, let's ask for the emails for that I simply choose uh, this uh, get user data because I want to collect the customer email so here make sure you have the email set right here and remove the skip so they have to enter the email to get the chat transcript so let's say what is uh, the uh, your email to send uh, the transcript so we simply ask them for the email so once they provide the email we want to set the email opt-in as well so that ensures that we can actually have the capabilities to send the email messages to them so here set email opt-in now we can actually send the email to the customer so here uh, you have to choose a send email over here and here click continue so if you want to have the if you want to actually send emails you have to actually first make sure uh, go to settings right here in channels make sure your email is already connected over here so we have tutorials or guides on how to connect your email channels so you can connect your own domain emails as well so that's a quick overview over there so let's go back to the email over here so here you can actually uh, build the chat subject over here so do a chat media chat transcript over here i can simply use the same thing as the uh, pre-header as well here you can actually if you want you can add any headlines buttons those kind of things i don't want to add those kind of things i simply want to send the chat transcript to the customer so here uh, let's go to that particular new updates over here and make sure to select this uh, variable over here 
chat history details large so let me choose this particular variable and select it over here so once this is done you can simply send any sort of emails as you like so i have set uh, the system field as you see here so let's test this how this actually works before that you have to make sure this is set as the default reply flow as well so go to the settings over here and in the general make sure you set chat transcript as the default reply over here so the default reply flow is set and in the integrations make sure this is switched off as well all right that's good so now we can actually test this one so as you see here first it simply send the request to the open ai and use the business information related to this particular plumping cooperation and respond to the customer and also provide the option for the customers so to send the chat transcript as well so that's a simple use case over here so let me simply send a message over here and see how this actually uh, respond to me over here so i send a message hi and it says hello how can i ask you today if you need a quote for plumbing services please provide me with this kind of details and also provide an option to send the chat transcript as well so let me ask where are you located so let me actually simply go through a few uh, chat conversation over here with the AI chatbot before we actually send the chat transcript and it simply says this is the location and we serve in these kind of areas so let me ask what services uh, do you provide what services uh, do you provide over here what services uh, do you provide so it should actually respond to us with the services offered by this uh, CBB plumbing corporation so let's see what it says so it simply says these are the services along with the links as well and let's see what is uh, the phone number so let's simply ask just simple questions before we actually send the chat transcript because we can actually have some sort of uh, back and forth conversation between the chatbot and the user as well and it says the phone number as well so now we actually have some sort of interactions right here let's send this chat transcript over here so let me choose a send chat transcript button over here it should ask us uh, for the email over here so let me enter an email over here i just placed an email over here so it should actually send me the chat transcript right now so here uh, one thing is that after we after the customer provides the email we haven't actually set any sort of uh, messages over here we only simply send the email over here so if you want you can actually add any sort of messages for the customer such as uh, thanks uh, the chat transcript has been sent to the email has been now sent to your email something like that just a confirmation message but in this case we don't have any sort of a messages set up right here so now let me check if i have actually received any sort of a emails over here so let me share my phone screen over here and as you see here it's simply your media chat transcript and it's simply use a bot what sort of questions i first i send hi and bot response like this after that it simply says where are you located i ask a question it's respond to me and after that i ask for the word services and it simply respond to me like this and also finally i ask for the phone number as well and it simply respond to me along with the it simply captures uh, the chat sent chat transcript as well because this is also interactions happened over there along with the uh, customer sharing the email as well so everything is recorded in this particular email as well so you can also use uh, this particular chat transcript in the open AI action over here for example here uh, let me show that so here in the actions open ai actions, uh, you can simply use generate text advance and here instead of business information you can simply paste uh, this particular variable over here copy paste this exact variable right here uh, and add a prompt for the open ai to analyze the chat history between this particular customer and the bot and ask uh, open ai to suggest any sort of improvements or ask open ai to detect any negative experience uh, uh, faced by the particular bot or customer over there so you can actually do a lot of things over here using this particular chat history details large uh, the system field we just introduced recently so if you have any other questions let us know in the comments thank you